All right, I wanted to tell you guys a little bit more about what life's like. And I just want to say that every single plant and every single person are the same. And oh, I just got to got to tell you the secret. You think I want to say. And it was that our skin is just like a plant and Clove wanted to say to you that he loves you too, but like, see how there's these little furry things on the, uh, like, it has fur on the furry fur, and it's just like skin on a really hot girl. You know, if you want me to be really honest, you know, because I really, really love peach fuzz. But anyway, when you breathe your skin, and if everything just smells like skin, it's not really it. It's got to be high skin. You know, like when you smoke and get high and, you know, you have that good feeling from smoking weed and you're like, oh, like I just fucked everything. I feel so good. You know, that kind of feeling is a real feeling. But every single plant actually stalks you all day long. If what your like preferred fresh smell is is like flowers and stuff, it's a good indicator that they are like totally like just watching you and like constantly, you know, like growing and like kind of like aiming right at you, you know, like someone who's like still eating food, you know. Like, if there was, like, a million dollars and it, there was, like, you know, like, a thousand people everywhere and they're, like, there's a pile of a million dollars and, um, I'm about to grab every single dollar. You know, they're, like, just grabbing the money. You know, you realize that, like, this could be freaking Caitlyn Sutton freaking leg because it's so hot. I mean, it has all these perfect little... You know, I mean, I couldn't even say into the person, man. I mean, I know. We're going to say none of that, man. I mean, but just how you could make this like skin and how you do it is pretty easy. But people and the plants can be like high skin and high people. You know, like if they took a hit of us, um, it's like having sex because, see, we need their breath to live. So if you ever wondered why, like, you smelled some hot girl's breath while she was sleeping, you know, and you're like, oh my God, I just want to smell your breath. That was actually this plant, you know, that you're smelling's breath because, see, it has a sexy smell to it when you actually want to get high and hit it, you know, like if, but if it was someone's breath that. Actually, it was like accidentally really good. Like, you know how people say that, you know, girls smell like flowers? Guys smell like flowers. You can make your body smell like a plant. Or you can make it smell like sexy flower good smell. You know, it doesn't have to be a flower. But it can be a sexy person blossom. You can be. Also, they're hermaphroditis. But it's for you. You know, and it, I mean, it's just that it's so delicate. I mean, just all these hairs on me, all these hairs on you, you know, and I mean, grass has it, plants have it, and they are committing, you know, bestiality. If there was maybe a law, I don't know. We have to figure out how that works. But what I thought was that, you know, maybe bestiality has to do with demons, you know, with the Jesus thing. Since he could, you know, plow you if there's a double negative or a triple negative, you know, and a, and a positive and a negative right next to each other, that'd be like saying, you know, yes, and then you said no, you know, if it's just a one, you know, but that's what that probably is. But, you know, plantality, or maybe it's called totality, I think that's it, or maybe fatality, you know, for when you pick a favorite, maybe that's the word favorite. But anyway, you know, our body is really beautiful, and it's so strokeable, and, you know, so pettable, you know, but 
when you just smell a plant and it just smells like a plant, it's supposed to have, you know, kind of a layer in between it. It's kind of like saying, like, here's the outer layer, you know, where I can push. And it's kind of like light. You know, that feels good and sexy if it, you know, feels good, you know. And then we have the, you know, um... <clears throat> Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I think that's all. I think that's all that touch should be. You know, it's just that good part. You know, there's the feeling part, I think. But anyway, yeah, I mean, I mean, I love you so much. Um, I don't know. But yeah, you can make yourself smell a lot better, and it doesn't have to be that, you know, fresh breeze and fresh soap. It's always what you have to smell like, you know. Um, you can also smell other, you can make, bring out better smells. And, you know, that's what it's all for.